When I first came out of the closet, I started using dating apps for the first time and I got hit up by this guy who was in his 50s. At the time, I didn't really understand or was confident about being into the whole older guys thing, right? So I showed some of my friends this message and just kind of laughed it off. And he had just hit me up at first and I played it off as if I wasn't interested, right? And I responded something politely saying that I wasn't interested because I'm never rude to people online. I don't understand people who are. But then later, this guy messaged me about all the different things he wanted to do to me in detail and they weren't really what you would expect. He actually just wanted to give me a massage. He went into detail about all the ways he would focus on giving me a massage and different areas he would hit that would be beyond what you would typically just go get a massage for or pay to get a massage for. And he was talking about focusing on parts of me that, again, I was kind of shy to talk about at the time, but really piqued my interest. So that excited me enough to respond to this guy and ask him a little bit more about what he would do, and he gave me some more details. I was not interested in this man, but I was interested in meeting up and getting this massage. So I kind of went into like clarification details and asked him like, you know, would you be keeping your shorts on? Are you okay with the fact that I'm only a top and only interested in that part of me having any attention paid to it at all and didn't want anything more than like, you know, a actual massage or maybe having some sort of a service work provided beyond that as long as it wasn't on the back door. He reassured me that yes, that would be fine and like he would totally respect my boundaries and all that. So I ended up deciding to meet up with this guy. So I show up there, he has a massage table open. He looks like how he looked in his pictures which I wasn't really interested in, but the whole idea of just meeting up with him and laying down on this table with nothing on really excited me. So he directed me to take everything off and get on the table face down. So I did, but with no sheet covering me like you would typically have. He started giving me a massage, which was really nice. And uh, you know, he started like, like grazing certain parts of me that I could not help but get excited about. I mean, I, I literally went to full attention while I was face on my back, face up on the massage table. He started to like grazing that area more and more and that got me even more excited. Then he was like full on grabbing that part of me, which felt amazing. But then he went from that to trying to hit that back part of me that I asked him not to and I had to clarify to him again that I really didn't want that. I didn't like anything in that area. And even though he tried, he was respectful of the fact that I wasn't into that as soon as I told him twice that that wasn't what I was into. All of this was fine, right? But at one point he said the weirdest thing to me, which I, and it was kind of out of the blue. He literally was like, kind of just chatting to me as I'm getting this massage from him. And he said that he reminded, or I reminded him of his son. He said that we were about the same age. Totally freaked me out and completely like took my full attention and went down to nothing. I mean, come on, that's really weird to say, right? Anyways, I finally got over that. He eased me back into things and um, he took his time doing what he said he was gonna do after about an hour long massage and really taught me that I really like it when a guy really spends his time working on that part of me or doing anything to me. I mean, the longer you spend doing something like that, the more you build something up, right? So by the time I uh, finished that massage, let's just say it was quite the uh, massive finish. The, a great conclusion. He even commented on how surprised he was by um, how good of a conclusion that was from what he could tell. Well, I guess I am a little awkward even talking about this still. So yeah, that was one of my first and only experiences with a guy of that age. Um, no judgment if that's your thing. It just wasn't my thing. But it was still really cool to explore and uh, try something a little out of the ordinary for me. And to this day, getting massages like that are like one of my favorite things ever. And a few other things like this have happened since then, but always the guys around my age, typically in like Puerto Vallarta from very attractive guys who, uh, that's their job, is to give massages, not necessarily any sort of happiness to those massages or the ending. Um, 
but that's often been the case and where it's led to. So if you guys want to hear more like stories about those, please let me know in the comments.